Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, can write this and multiply x times x as same thing as x squared over 5 times 5, 5 squared equals to also here we have 5 times 5, that's 5 squared over x times x, which is x squared. The next step here, cross multiply x squared times x squared. Then also equals to here we have 5 squared times 5 squared. And also this follows when we have a times a, you can write it as a squared. And the same thing multiply, you can write it as x squared or squared equals to also here we have 5 squared or squared. The next step here, take the right hand side to left hand side, and we have x squared all squared minus 5 squared all squared, then equals to 0 here. Then, yeah, this follows when we have a squared minus b squared, which can be written as a plus b into bracket and open bracket a minus b. And this here is standing as x squared. And B standing as 5 squared. Then what we have here becomes x squared plus 5 squared into brackets. Also, open bracket x squared minus 5 squared close bracket, then equals to 0 here. Then we have two possible cases here. The first one x squared plus 5 squared equals to 0 here or we have x squared minus 5 squared equals to 0 here then so on this side this follows when we have a squared plus b squared this is the same thing as a plus b r into bracket also open bracket a minus b i close bracket that is here what we have becomes x plus 5i into brackets, also open bracket x minus 5i close bracket equals to 0 here. That is, we have two possible cases here x plus 5i equals to 0, or we have x minus 5i equals to 0 here. Then solving from here, we have x equals to minus 5i which is a complex solution and here we have x equals to 5i which is also a complex solution then so from the second case here this also follows when we have a square minus b square the same thing as a plus b into bracket open bracket a minus b and this here this becomes x plus 5 into bracket open bracket x minus 5 close bracket equals to 0 here so this also we have two possible cases x plus 5 equals to 0 or we have x minus 5 equals to 0 here and solving from here this gives us x equals to minus 5 which is a real solution here also here we have x equals to 5 which is also the re solution here making two re solutions from here and all together we have four solutions two re and two complex solutions then when we write it out from here what we have becomes the first solution x1 can be written as 5 as x1 equals to 5 x2 equals to minus 5 x3 equals to 5i then x4 equals to minus 5i making four solutions together in this problem two real and two complex now you can check if this satisfies this given problem substitute the value of x into this equation when x equals to 5, this equation becomes 5 over 5 times 5 over 5. Is it equals to 
5 over 5 also times 1 over 5. So 5 over 5, that's the same thing as 1 times also 1. Is it equals to 5 over 5? 1 times also 1. 1 times 1 leave us 1, which is equals to 1 times 1, 1. Left hand side equals to right hand side. That is, let's equals to 5 here, yeah? satisfy this given problem. And also substitute x equals to minus 5. Then this equation becomes minus 5 over 5 times minus 5 over 5. Is it equals to 5 over minus 5 times 5 over minus 5? Minus 5 over 5, that's minus 1 times also minus 1. Is it equals to here? Yeah, 5 over minus 5, same thing as minus 1 times minus 1. Minus times minus is plus. This becomes 1, which is equals to also minus times minus plus. And 1 times 1, 1. At this left hand side, it equals to right hand side. And x equals to minus 5 also satisfy this given problem. And also, we substitute x equals to 5i. This equation becomes 5i over 5 times 5i over 5. Is it equals to 5 over 5i times 5 over 5i? And 5i over 5, I write that as i times also i. Is it equals to here? I write as 1 over i times 1 over i i times i same thing multiplying that same thing as i square equals to here we have 1 over i times i also i square we should note that i square equals to minus 1 as this here we have minus 1 this is equals to 1 over minus 1 and here we have minus 1 equals to 1 over minus 1 also minus 1 left hand side equals to the right hand side that is x equals to 5i also satisfy this given problem then we substitute x equals to minus 5i and what we have also becomes minus 5i over 5 times minus 5i over 5 is it equals to 5 over minus 5i times 5 over minus 5i? Then here, yeah, minus 5 over 5, that's the same thing as minus i times also minus i. Is it equals to, here yeah, we can raise as 1 over minus i times 1 over minus i. And minus times minus plus i times i, that's i square. Is it equals to, also here, yeah, 1 times 1, 1. Minus i times minus i, i squared. And i squared, same thing as minus 1. We have minus 1. Is it equals to 1 over minus 1? And here we have minus 1, which is equals to 1 over minus 1, that's minus 1. Left hand side equals to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude that x equals to minus 5i also satisfy this given problem. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps. Subscribe for more videos and turn your notification bell. Share this video with your comments. See you next class and bye for now.